And we're back with the latest on the search for the two gunmen still on the run nearly a week after Memorial Day shooting on Hollywood Beach. As police continue the manhunt, we're hearing from another victim caught in the gunfire. Local 10 crime specialist Bridget Matter is live in Hollywood with more. Well, we spoke to two mothers of two different victims who have had surgeries and they are just starting their long road to recovery. Tonight, police looking for at least two more suspects connected to this shooting. Nine people survived gunshot wounds while celebrating Memorial Day on Hollywood Beach. Among the victims, a 16 month old baby boy named Amari. He's doing OK. He can't walk for a little while. Uh, that's very, you know, it's so hard to see him have to go through this as a very active one year old who just began walking. He should be experiencing his first moments. Amari was shot in the leg. His mother says watching her son in pain is tough. He's having a hard time. He has some pain and he'll have some recovering to do. Cell phone video shows the moments after of people wounded on the beach. The shooting was a result of two groups arguing. Bullets flew in every direction. Latroya Stone's son was also hit. Shots to the chest and to the stomach. He had to have a major surgery on his stomach. U.S. Marshals Fugitive Task Force and Hollywood Police brought Jordan Burton into custody Saturday afternoon. He's the third person arrested in connection to the shooting. Police are working to locate Ariel Cardone Paul and Lionel Jean Charles Jr. They need to hurry up and find the other two that was involved in the shooting. And police add if you are at and in any way helping these two people that they are still looking for that you will also be facing serious charges for now we're live in Hollywood Beach Bridget matter local 10 news.